Hi everyone, thank you for letting me to share my uh, morning with you and uh, just want to share this um, about how to use this interdental brush effectively and cleaning our teeth really well without damaging our gum and our teeth. A uh, lot of times, you know, when dentists or hygienists rec recommended this to you, to use it every night after we floss and brush our teeth. There's once a day in the evening only. When we use it, this design, they have a cap to come with it. Here you can see I have two different sizes. The orange size is number three for bigger gap, and then the pink size is number zero for smaller gaps. Because in our mouth, some people have very, very tiny gap, some people have very big gaps, okay? So I'm going to show you how to use it. This is the dental prop. It's made in Japan. It's the best quality and I find it my clients and myself have been using it for the last 20 years. And it's really good and durable, clean really well. And so when we use it, the cap come with that. There is a reason for it. When we are going traveling and we put the caps in there so they keep it nice and hygienic and the bristles will not get damaged. But when we need to use it, we need to use the cap. So lots of people hasn't been told. So put the handle right into the cap to make the handle longer. Before we use it, now preparation is everything. If we prepare things right, and everything will be easier for us. So bang them once and make it 45 degrees. And then when we use it, we I share with my clients that to do the outside of the teeth first. When they are really good at doing the cleaning of the outside of their teeth, then I am going to share with them how to do the inside. So when we do it, we need to bite our teeth together when we are cleaning the outside. So the top teeth edge here and the bottom teeth edge here and bite together like this. So when we are doing it, we are actually doing it like that from one side to the other side. Go in there, the back, then in here, in here, here. The gap can't get in because they're too small. So see how I then do the top teeth? Remember, bite your teeth together. Lean on the gum. Can't get in, so do the other side. So I've done all the top teeth. After that, we do the smaller gaps with the smaller brush. Same again, push the handle into the cap really tight, make it longer, bang it once only, and then do the tight gap. See how the, this one, get into the tight gap very easily. Notice when I'm using it, and I want to make sure, after we've done that, if there's any plaques on the brushes here, you've got a glass of water here, and give them a little wee rinse, a little wee rinse, okay? And then just keep it there when we finish, and put it in the cups there, the glass, for the next night, okay? So, this is the way we do it. Make sure we lean on the gum, and very gentle, whatever we do to clean our teeth. It's very gentle. You have a great day and I see you next time.